Hello, fellas. Well, I've seen a couple videos out there with uh, audio glitching, warping sounds going on. I've had it myself, and oh this is about the lead lighting video because I'm about to install some lead lights here in the lab, and uh, I thought I'd just do some uh, measurements, get it on camera, try and show you the difference. Although it is hard to get that on video, but we'll try and get some measurements anyway. Now the solution that I found that worked for me was making sure that in here see you go to control panel go down to sounds alright you'll have a bunch of audio devices listed usually it will tell you what's working by the audio output uh, display right here and what you'll want to do is go into your properties and over to advance and usually make sure all these are the same setting that you got your software set to. Say you've got your software set to 48 Hertz, uh, your Stream Easy Hoppage Capture software, you'll want to make sure that all your audio devices are at that capture setting. Like 48K, 48K. For some reason that one's not, but whatever. And uh, if you've got an ASUS Zonar, make sure you go into the software after you set that in the sound settings for Windows and make sure the sample rate is on the setting that you need it to be. So I'm using 48K on everything. 24-bit, 48K. And that's including on your streaming computer, the computer that you've got the HD PVR connected to that you're streaming with. Make sure that this, you know, you've got everything set up on the same sample rate everywhere. If you're broadcasting sound from your streaming computer, say you're uh, playing music on there, and yeah, you want to make sure everything's the same. Also, another thing that you'll want to watch on your streaming computer, the computer that you've got the HD PVR connected to that you're streaming to, make sure that it's not running out of CPU usage. If you get 100%, 90% CPU usage, it's going to cause glitching and warping in the audio uh, encoder. So, yeah, you also get a uh, digitalization, pixelization of your video image. It'll look like little blurry blocks of discolored uh, pixels on your uh, video. Or it'll, it will get blurry. Or it will freeze up and then do a fast forward and then freeze up and fast forward and such and such. So make sure that your CPU usage stays below like 90 percent if possible and make sure that you've got enough RAM because if you run out of RAM bad things happen. Anyways that fixed it for me if y'all come across anything else or y'all need a little